it's Pukki Digit here and today's review of the day which you can see in front of your very own eyes and this is none other than the Special Memorized Ochomacho Doremi and as you can see right here this is it the remake version from the very first season of this tablet or to my far right so this one was back in like in year 1999 or 2000 which is quite a long time and I actually purchased this one on Amazon that bit it directly uh, from Japan so anyways, we'll focus on this one right now because there are some comparisons that I want to share between this one, the newest one, and the one for the year 1999 version. So as you can see, the box itself is like very peach pink version. And you can see the details on this box right here. It's a really nice uh, detailing, just simple, but I really like that. And even the words they're special memorized is all written in rainbow colors. And you can see feature none other than the main protagonist. So inside there is the manual instructions and then the tab itself. So at the back right over here, it already comes along with the three LR44 batteries. It's already inside, which I am glad for that because I only have two on my possession, so I didn't have time to buy one. So I'm glad that they have a backup for it already. So without further ado, let's get opening this box. So after opening the box itself, and my gosh, I really do like the boxing itself. And it showcased the when during me actually say the words, and then it shows like this just to cast a spell. And same thing at the bottom right over here of the side of the box. So it's a very cute feature to showcase this special memorized version tab. So let's put this right over here. And now to show you this tab itself. So before I will do the comparison on my far right, which is the year 1999. So let's go over here first. And I did already remove the tag, which I don't know where it flew off to. Oh, right over here. So it already comes along with the batteries, which I just mentioned a few minutes ago. So thankfully for that, because I didn't have one more LR44 battery. I was missing one more because this one provides three LR44. Well, on the 1999 version, it's actually two AAA batteries so that's a slight differences for the functionalities there be some slight differences so I'm just going to be pointing out which ones the differences a bit later so now we'll go to the t detailing first on this beautiful special memorized version tab and you can see the glossiness the gold rings on it the gold lines it really outstanding features and even the marbles I do love its touch right over there it's more easier to move and swing it along like that Comparing to the far right because it's more chunkier and thicker, but still can be uh, movable, but not removed. Can be like running around what I'm doing. I also like the feeling when you can just move it around. It's really, really a nice touch. Even the musical note as you sway it along, it's also the same thing for the one on the 1999 version. Then at the back, there's a speaker right over here. Instead of the bottom, it moves to the top, and the speaker is of course just right over here and the curvings you can see the musical notes and the stars right over there and you can see if you want to open right over here the, this one just press this tiny button right over here and just this lid will up, uh, open and already on this one so don't worry so once you open it, it's actually on the off but I just on it just for a little bit advanced so without that let's go for the musical notes right over here so you can see there's total of eight right so the functionalities with this will be the same as the year 1999. So let's press the one right over here. Oh, and for that, so this one as well is a little bit different because if you press longer, it will comes with the opening song, which I'm not going to do it right here just to avoid the copyright strike. So apologies for that. But if you press one time, it will you will actually hear when Dory Me transform into the witch, which this one actually do have. But if you want to stop the music in the middle of the transformation, this on the other hand cannot. But the 99 version, it can. So let's press this one first. Just listening to this music oh, brings so much memory, so much childhood moments. And now let's go to the eight musical notes. So it's the same thing, but this is actually a little bit different because if you play the 1999 version, you know Doremi Fasolatito's Clock Quest, right? But on this special memorized version, it's anti clockwise. Yep, believe it or not. So let's go for the 99 version first, right over here. 
So we'll do the clockwise first. So a bit, a uh, little bit like a low volume because of this number one and number two. It's a little, it's kind of old. You may notice of the tan color. So you can notice I press it clockwise, right? So let's put that down. But this one is anti-clockwise. So they want to follow from the anime, which is reasonable. So let's go to what it says. So you can hear it is anti-clockwise instead of clockwise. So it comes along with eight different notes. So the ones you hear is the original one. So if we go press on this one, it will change the same thing, same as for the year 99 version. So I'm going to show it one by one. So now with the extra bonus, so aside from pressing longer to hear the opening song, right, for this version, but that version don't have, but on this version, 1999, as you shake it, there'll be the sound that comes along continuously when you have the eight tones together. Like as you keep shaking, you hear the, the notes would change to another note. But this one, when I keep shaking it, it doesn't have, even I on it right over here, it's still on, it doesn't hear anything, like not at all. So now we go to the second bonus, which this 1999 version don't have. Which when Doremi actually tried to press the buttons to unleash the uh, Pepperunton wand and her broom, which we will go for the wand first. However, after trying to analyze this for like nearly 5 minutes, only one specific note, which is when you press this button right over here, you hear that sound of a piano wand, right? Only that sound can activate that, while the other 7 tones, it will not activate. So that's to my realization. So let's try doing the Domi si Do, uh, Do Mi So Do, that's for the wand. So Do Mi So Do. And that will unleash Doremi's wand. So if you want to unleash the broom on the other hand, that is Do Fa La Do. So it's Do Fa La Do. You hear the ones they unleash the broom. So let's say if I go to another node, let's say this one right here for example. So it's going to be a different sound like you hear right? Like that. So if I want to do the broom, for example, it doesn't. And now with this opening music, right? I mean the transformation, even how much I want to stop, it will not stop. So, so that's a slight difference that when it comes to the transformation music, for that one, it can stop. But on this, on the other hand, it cannot stop. Even when I accidentally press a bit too long just to find out how to activate the broomstick and the wand uh, musical note, I have to wait at least around nearly two minutes until that opening music had to stop because I can't forcefully stop. Even if I off it right over here, I'm just going to break and damage this object, which I don't want to. So I just wait patiently and enjoy the music for my uh, childhood memories. So, in my conclusion, I really really enjoy playing this even though it's just like a small feature but I really really do love the functionalities and even the tones of right over here. It really goes well and surprisingly, instead of going to the clockwise, it goes anti-clockwise and it's based from the anime. So I do respect what uh, Bandai is doing there and then if it comes to the functionalities that this one have but this one don't which it doesn't really bother me that much 
However, I really do miss the shaky moment where you hear the different kinds of songs like that. Yeah, I mean tones, my bad. They could have actually provided here, but I don't know why they did not, and it's a really big bummer. Plus, I have actually one point that I really want them to put the ending song, the Ashitawa. If that's the ending music, if I sing that correctly, Ashitawa. It would be nice feature if they could put it another over here. Like you press longer, you have the first one, and then the you press it longer again, but without pressing and you know directly to open the you know feature the transformation. It would be a lovely, lovely feature if they will also provide the ending music. So that's a little um, two points that I want to point out is the shaky moment that they remove it from the year 1999 and they could have actually put a the ending music in this tab itself because it showcased the special memorize anyways i still love it overall and i will give this a rate because it's nearly close to perfectionist and brings me so much childhood memories so i'm gonna give this a chance for 9 out of 10 for my overall rating if you did enjoy this everyone for my review of the day of the special memorize ochimachi dory me tab down below have you pre-ordered this or not if you have it on your hand or not feel free to comment down on this video and of course if you did enjoy it don't forget to give this video the like button subscribe to my channel and i will see you all in the next review